First end pads is always a little bit of a struggle. I'm uh, kind of wondering who uh, stuck the weights in my, uh, my front shoulder pads. It kept falling on my face a few times, but other than that, you know, it is what it is. It, we got a long way to go, but uh, I think it was good for everybody to kind of get the pads on. You, know, you go through a couple days of, of what we call spiders, you know, those little foam pads, and everyone's getting a little too aggressive by day two. Everyone's kind of itching to, to get out there and prove themselves. And like I said yesterday, you know, we got a long way to go, but you're going to start seeing some guys, I think, step up and start proving themselves, and we're going to find out who we got. How excited are you to get uh, Arian back out there and, uh, and get some reps with you guys? Well, it's always, I mean, come on, he's the, he's the best running back in the league. He's a guy that, uh, you know, you can't simulate what he's going to do. He's a special back, and, um, you know, it's going to be exciting, I think, to have all those guys back. You know, we got a lot of good players that are going to be coming in here the next day or two, going to be starting practice. Uh, I'm excited about it. I think any time you set the, the bar that high, it's, it's kind of fun to try to go hit it again. Do you guys see a lot of pressure in the offensive line? I mean, you've got so many special skills guys that are out there that everybody talks about in the NFL, and you guys are the ones that get it started up front. You know, I don't look at it as pressure. I look at it as, as, a, as a chance to, to make big plays. And, um, you know, you don't have to give Arian a whole lot, and he's going to go. You don't have to give a guy like Matt Schaub much of a pocket because he can sling it, you know, Andre Johnson, those guys. And so I, I look at it like, hey, we just got to give these guys a chance. We don't have to do anything special. We don't have to do anything. We're out extraordinary. We've got to open up huge holes to get running. We just got to do the, what we do, and these guys have already proven that they're going to go out there and, and open up big stuff. Now you yeah. guys have a lot of pressure to be physical as well. I mean, Michael Marty came out the other day and said yeah. had that comment about what you said about practice and yeah. pads, but, I yeah. mean, you know, the, it still stands that you guys are anchoring one of the best offenses yeah. in the league. Well, I know this, you know, you don't look into 16-16. You don't look into 2,000 yards rushing as a team. You don't look into that kind of stuff. So you can call it whatever you want. You can call it finesse. You can call it whatever. But I'll take those yards. I'll take the touchdown, and I'll take that production. So Michael Lombardi can call it whatever he wants. He can come out here. And, you know, I've never seen him at practice before. So I don't know, maybe he'll have a different take on it if he's not 2,000 miles away uh, commenting on something he's never seen before. So, you know, that's kind of the old school mentality with all this as well. You know, if you're not hitting every day, if you're not doing that, then I guess you're not tough. You know, and I'm not going to worry about that. That's something that, you know, if we can go out there, we can get Arian Foster over 1,600 yards again, we can get Matt Schaub to 4,000, and we can score those big touchdowns in the key moments, then you can call us whatever you want. Talk a little bit about uh, the defense. Uh, that's obviously been the Achilles heel for this team for years. What have you seen from Wade Phillips in the defense? And uh, they've really been challenging you guys on offense. Well, obviously, they're aggressive. I mean, Wade's, Wade's been an aggressive coordinator everywhere he's been. He's going to continue that. I think we got great athletes to give him a chance to be aggressive, and I think that's what's important. So, um, you know, it, it's going to be fun. These practices are going to be challenging. I think it's going to make us a better offense, and I, and I hope that we're going to make them a better defense because, like, you know, we're all in it together. You know, if uh, if we don't score, then we can't win. If they don't keep them out of the end zone, then it's hard for us to win. So, uh, you know, it's, it all comes in together. I think we all, both got to challenge each other, but at the end of the day, I think we're going to make each other better.